Live from Case at 12. The 6 o'clock news starts right now. Sheriff Javier Salazar accused in federal court today of wrongfully arresting the former property manager of an East Bear County mobile home park. John Ripley says he was targeted by Salazar after criticizing the sheriff's efforts to clean up that troubled property. Dylan Collier takes a closer look at the lawsuit. <laughs> A county spokesperson confirms the last of Jasper Park's residents have now moved on. What remains is a massive cleanup project and now a federal civil rights lawsuit filed by the property's former manager. At issue, the arrest last May of John Ripley, a part owner and former manager of Jasper Park. Sheriff's investigators say Ripley was responsible for diverting more than $9,000 in water by removing a water meter and installing illegal pipes. But a lawsuit filed in federal court this week points out that such a scheme offered no economic gain for Ripley, whose misdemeanor charge of criminal mischief was dismissed by prosecutors last fall. His attorney says detectives should have focused their efforts elsewhere. You got to get out there and stop those murderers, stop, stop those child molesters. But instead, went after an innocent man who hasn't been shy about his criticism of Salazar. The sheriff used a lot of detectives to get back at John for speaking. Ripley, as far back as January 2019, said BCSO unfairly focused on him instead of tenants responsible for code violations at the park because it made for simpler work. I don't know what all the deputies were doing here except standing there. Today, Ripley recalled his arrest when deputies, at least one of which had a gun drawn, took him into custody. They arrested me, I was in my underwear, I finally convinced them to allow me to put my pants on. For the defenders, Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.